Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to create this really simple but kind of glamorous makeup. It's just a neutral kind of look with a pop of orange. I absolutely love it for spring. So if you want to see it, then keep on watching. And so I started off by just taking this awesome palette by Morphe Brushes. I'm so excited to be using this in my video. And I'm just taking this warm brown color and first just placing it into my crease and then blending it above just to get a really smooth, crisp, uh, blunt <laughs> and then I'm just putting a little bit more in my outer V just to make sure that I have the Depth that I really want because that's all I'm really doing with this shadow I'm just kind of creating depth and placing a shadow there so my eyes look a little bit bigger But we're not going to create this big old intricate um, eye look so I'm doing the exact same thing on the other side and making sure to put a little bit more of that same exact shadow in the outer crease just to give me a little bit more depth and then I'm going to take this shimmery eyeshadow and I'm going to place a little bit on my brow bone. I don't like using a lot of shimmer on my brow bone. I feel like it could be a little bit too harsh so I'm just placing a really small amount and then I'm going to also place that pretty heavily right into the inner corner but right before I did that I actually did blend the highlight color and the crease color together just because I'm a blending freak and I just have to make sure it's blended. And then I'm placing that same crease brown color underneath my eyes just to kind of give myself a lower lash line. I'm not really, you know, doing too much with this color, but just kind of making it apparent that I do have a lower lash line and just to make my eyes look a little bigger. Now I'm going to be taking this flat brush and this black from the Naked 2 palette and I'm just going to smudge that right onto the outer, outer part of my upper lash line. And what this is going to do is it's going to give a little more a little bore, a little more like pop to the outer part of my eye just so my lashes look a little, I don't know, it just it gives a little nice accent and as you can see it just helps a little bit with your lashes and so I'm just going to curl them lashes because they're stick straight naturally and I'm going to be applying a few mascaras. I will have them listed down below. I have been using my Unique uh, mascara. I did do a first impression on it. I love it. And um, I have been using it a lot more, especially on these looks where I don't do crazy, you know, eyeshadow. I really want these big, fluttery lashes. And so I'm going to go right ahead to bronzing. I already did my face. And as you can see, this bronzer is just absolutely beautiful and shimmery. I did get it in my BoxyCharm. And I'm just taking this large brush. And I'm not going to contour whatsoever. I'm just kind of brushing it onto my face and I am pinching the brush a little bit for a little bit more control but nothing too you know sculpting or anything like that we are just bronzing to give a little bit of color to my really white face and so then after that I'm gonna take this really really pigmented orange and I absolutely love this blush but it is insanely pigmented so I only dip it into the compact once and then I brush a bunch of it off on the back of my hand and then I start to really gently pat on my face and once I feel like a good amount of product has already gone off my brush I'll go ahead and swipe pretty you know a little bit more hard so I can just blend it really nicely and evenly on my cheek and my cheekbones and all that and then I'm gonna take my favorite highlighter and I'm only taking the second strip with which is just a light gold and I'm going to be placing that on the top of my cheekbones and above my brow and just dusting it real real slightly in the center of my face just for a really nice glowy look because this is a springy summer look so I like to be super glowy but now I'm just taking this lip liner and I'm just outlining my lips just to give myself you know some outline and as you can see I was really excited about this lipstick I absolutely love it again I got it in this, uh, my boxy charm and it's just this beautiful absolutely beautiful orange and I feel like it's wearable but it's I don't know it's just such an intense color it's not for everyone but I absolutely love it and you don't have to wear an orange you can wear a nude but yeah I absolutely love this look let me know if you recreate it and yeah I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys later Bye.